Patrick Mahomes' wife, Brittany, gave Eli Apple a taste of his own medicine after the Chiefs beat the Bengals on Sunday, trolling the cornerback for running his mouth in the days leading up to the game. As soon as the Bengals were booted from the Super Bowl contention, it was Brittany's time to get the last laugh. Brittany tweeted, Cancun on three. It wasn't just the superstar's wife going after Eli Apple following the game because the Chiefs players unleashed on him while smoking victory cigars in the locker room. Check out the video. Right now, I forgot. Eli Apple, I'm going to smoke one for you. I forgot. I forgot. Eli Apple. 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 Eli Eli Apple was oozing confidence on social media after the Bengals eliminated Buffalo last week, channeling his Ina Patrick Beverly and telling the Bills players to enjoy their early vacation as the Cincinnati Bengals moved on in the playoffs. After the game, Marquez Valdez Scanlon also took time to clown Eli Apple in a post-game interview. Check out the video. People don't realize because it doesn't show up in the stat sheet. You get the big penalty on Eli Apple. That's the hold. That's an automatic first down. What about that play? Yeah, you know, I was just whooping him all game. You know, and uh, you know that was just another play where he couldn't couldn't cover me well enough, and uh, you know got the flag, and we we moved it up. Okay. Even Patrick Mahomes' dad has some words for the bingo superstar quarterback. Joe Burrow. Check out what he had to say. You got a cigar on your own, I see. Yeah, I'm smoking the Joe Burrow. You smoking on the Joe Burrow? I'm smoking on the Joe Burrow. How's know? it feel to be headed back to Super Bowl? Uh, it feels great, you know. You know, my baby boy did what he always do. You know, he going to show up and, and show out. And I'm just glad he did it. The Chiefs played like they were pissed off and Travis Kelsey and others made it clear they felt disrespected by Mike Hilton referring to Arrowhead Stadium as Burrowhead. Now the Chiefs will prep for the Philadelphia Eagles in the Super Bowl and only one team will be talking that talk when it's all said and done. May the best man win.